Hi everybody, it's Donna with Donna's Deals and DIYs and I hope you're having a great day. I have a Dollar Tree haul for you today, but it, I don't really have very much. And so when I get finished showing you the Dollar Tree haul, I'm also gonna show you what I bought my mom for Mother's Day, which is coming up next weekend. So I have nine days of school left with the kids and 10 days left of school altogether, plus next weekend. So that is 12 days all together until my summer break. And I'll be looking for some kind of part-time job, maybe temp job this uh, year, this summer, uh, so I can save up some money to go on vacation this year and next year. Because <laughs> uh, we, my friend, best friend, and I want to go on a cruise next summer, but we, uh, I'm planning on going somewhere this summer, but I have not, we have not decided where yet. And I'm doing some research. I'm going to try to finalize that research this week and get with her so that I can go ahead and get everything booked and ready to go because it's going to be more expensive the more we wait. So anyway, um, thank you for watching my channel today. I have some new subscribers. I'm up to like 720 now. Thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. I appreciate you doing that and very, very much. And I do have a YouTuber of the week. Her name is Spanglish247 and I'm going to link her below. Please go check out her channel. Uh, YouTube friend of the week. Okay, now I went to my local Dollar Tree. I have been looking for the charger plates for the Shore Living Collection. Yes, you saw them in my thumbnail. And I have a subscriber that was looking for them. She contacted a friend of hers in South Carolina. They didn't have them at the stores up there. She's going to travel to South Carolina. Thank you, friend. She was gonna look for me, uh, look for them up there. So I went into the store yesterday and talked to my manager and said, hey, have you got these charger plates in? Nobody's gotten them. I have looked at five different Dollar Trees in the local area in a Dollar Tree slash Family Dollar Plus store and have not found them at all and you know he said well we got some gray ones in and i'm like no these are not gray they're blue and then i showed him a picture of them on my pinterest page i have a pinterest page that shows all my wish list items or most of my wish list items and uh showed them to him and he goes oh yeah we got those and so he goes and opened the box just for me to sell me two of them which i was so excited so thank you jose if and so these are just green briar of course but these are the charger plates that go with the shore living um collection as far as the uh dinnerware goes so as soon as school's out i'm going to put a white tablecloth on our dining room table we don't hardly ever eat there but we like to decorate it and i'm going to put the uh dinnerware down and decorate it and i have some uh, centerpiece that i'm making for the table and so i will take a picture of that and show you i just don't have a lot of energy right now between now and then so it's going to have to be after <laughs> <laughs> school's out so I'm so excited I picked up two one for me and one for mom so because we just got I just got the two the two sets of uh, the shore living um, very very excited to find these there are a couple of more things in the shore living collection I'm looking for uh, I don't absolutely have to have them but there are a couple of things I would mind having if I can find them but I haven't seen them at any of our local stores and next Saturday we have a family reunion with cousin Jan and so I will be taking pictures of course with cousin Jan and my cousin Kay which I think I've showed y'all some pictures with cousin Kay before she's the cousin one of my cousins I have that lives as closest to me so and I know the two of them don't mind being on my channel so anyway we're excited about that family reunion next Saturday and I'll have to try to run to the Dollar Tree in between all that and the last two weeks of school are really busy. We have field day. We have a day that we're going to a water park for the kids who met their reading goals. We have award ceremonies. We have kindergarten graduation. It's just a lot going on. So, <laughs> and we were moving classrooms. We moved classrooms on Friday and I was just really tired when I got home and I'm still pretty tired. So I'm trying to chill out today and just maybe do a little bit of research and get this video out. So not really sure what's gonna happen on Friday, if I'm gonna have a video or not, or if the video is gonna be on Saturday or Sunday. So, but sometime next weekend, either Friday, Saturday, or Sunday, I will have a second video, but I'm just not sure what day or what the content will be, but be looking for it. I do have some pictures of some stuff that I saw at the Dollar Tree that I did not purchase that I will be putting at the end of this video. 
All right, I picked up another bag for mom for Mother's Day because I had uh, some more stuff that I purchased for her and it wouldn't all fit in that first bag. And so I picked up this one. It has a lot of blue flowers on it. I just thought it was so pretty. She loves blue and she loves red. And this is just a voila, voila. Very similar to the last one that I purchased that was pink and green and has some yellow and orange in it. This is blue and green. So very pretty, just voila. I always take these old tabby things off because they get on my nerves. But um, anyway, I will be putting everything in these two bags for her for Mother's Day and give them, give them to her next Sunday when it's Mother's Day. So, um, oh, there we go. Finally got it off. Anyway, so I got that bag for her. I thought it was beautiful. Let's see what else I have. Oh, I got this Brillo. I could not find any more of the palm olive dish spray that was in the spray like this that we got for her, but I got her the Brillo Basics dish spray, dishwashing soap spray. It's fresh scent, 10 fluid ounces, three times the action. It says it dissolves stuck on grease and grime quick and easy. So I picked this up for her because she really likes that other one, the palm olive one, but couldn't find it. So I thought, well, hey, she can use this one instead. It will, I'm sure just work just as well. So I did see this, picked it up for her. For the kitchen. We have a dishwasher, but sometimes, you know, we just like to wash, hand wash and stuff real quick. All right, let's see what else I picked up. I picked up a couple of repurchases. I picked up another one of these sticks. I'm not going to pull the tab, but I have already purchased one of these. The one that I pulled the tab on, I was afraid by the time we put these out in the front yard, the battery was gonna go down or whatever, and I didn't feel like messing with, trying to see how to put a battery in it, if there is a way. Uh, so I just went ahead and bought a sixth, seventh one so that if that one stops working by the time we put these in the front yard, we will have six that actually work because we've got six in the front yard right now and one of them I don't think has ever worked, but I didn't take it back. I just left it out there. <laughs> it was one of those lantern looking ones. So, but I love this one. I think it's great. Wonderful. They have some red, white, and blue ones for uh, the 4th of July that I also love at the Dollar Tree. If you, um, and then I saw some more new ones. I thought this was going to be my last time to purchase these for our yard. Then I saw paw prints that you just kind of stick toward the bottom of the ground. And you know, I'm going to have to have six of those paw print ones. <laughs> Cause we have a dog and we're hoping someday to get a new one. So, cause my little Shih Tzu's get, she's 13. She's getting old. She turned 13 last month or this month in May. Yeah, she turned 13 this month in May. So we love her. She's in good health, but you never know uh, how much longer we're going to have around. Maybe about another two years. So we want to get another Shih Tzu or another dog, a little dog. I picked these pawns up because I was out of face wipes and I'm looking for the Yes Two ones. We never got the Amy ones here. I'm looking for the Yes 2 ones. I'm hoping that I might be able to run over to the Dollar Tree in our, the Dollar Tree stores, or at least one of them in our town over next weekend while we're at our family reunion, but I just don't know. We'll see. I'm hoping, hoping. And um, that these are pawns formulated by the Pawns Institute. Purify and refresh, gently cleanses and hydrates, effectively removing makeup, dirt, and impurities. Makeup remover facial wipes with aloe vera extract and you get pre moistened facial wipes there's only 10 in here but it is palms and they're made in korea now i got these just to go ahead and use for the next couple of weeks till i go and maybe can find a bigger package of something else uh, or maybe go on a road trip i'm hoping to maybe go on a road trip to the houston area as soon as school's out with my friend dina and hopefully we'll find some of these great things that we've been missing down here. This would be absolutely perfect to take on your vacation. If you're going on a vacation or a cruise or something, this is perfect to pack in your uh, carry-on bag or your suitcase. Does not take up a lot of room to wipe your makeup off with. So perfect travel size package for that. And a very good name brand as well. All right, y'all, here's another bag here. Uh, there is something new and something repurchased here. So let me, and something for my mom. Okay, so I got this hint water. This is a repurchase. This is the coconut hint water. It has zero calories. It's water infused with coconut essence and other natural flavors. And I really like the coconut. I only picked up one uh, to take with me this week for work, maybe for lunch or something. Uh, and it doesn't expire until July 23rd of 2024, which I don't even know how water would expire anyway, but I guess the 
flavors or something in there. But anyway, it's a 16 fluid ounce and I really like these. For a dollar and a quarter, they're not, it's not a bad price, but I really like the coconut. It does have just a hint of coconut, but I really like the way it tastes. It is my favorite of the hemp water. Then I found this exciting new item at the Dollar Tree. It was called Vitamin Water Zero Sugar. Now, I like to get the zero sugar because I am diabetic or pre, yeah, diabetic. My doctor took me off my diabetes medicine um, and told me I couldn't get my A1C, could not go over 6.7. It usually runs around 5.7 so or 5.4. So that is like a whole, over a whole point or more for me to have to jump up to before she's concerned about it. She had to take me off of it due to my liver enzymes. But um, vitamin water, uh, this is Forever You Coconut Lime. And this is something I am excited to try. I will be taking it to work next week for lunch and uh, it has five calories, zero sugar, zero carbs. It does have potassium, vitamin C, niacin, and vitamin B12 and magnesium. B12 is something I really need something, I need some of that, so it's a good thing to have that. And um, I'm just really excited about this being the zero sugar. I wish they'd have had more flavors that I'd been interested in. The only other zero sugar one that I saw was a raspberry dark chocolate, uh, which I'll overly hear. It was a little, I just didn't know y'all. If anybody's tried it, let me know. I love dark chocolate, raspberry's great. I just didn't know how I wanna taste it when I'm drinking water or drinking a liquid. I, that's more like a hot chocolate type thing or a dessert type thing, not something I just wanna drink. But coconut lime is way up my, so I may want another one of these and if I really like it, I'll probably pick up a couple more. But I just wanted to try it, so excited. Then they had some that were not zero sugar and some other flavors that you'll see at the end of my video. Uh, mom said she had a problem with an ant in her one somewhere around here in the house and so uh, we don't need any ants in the house. So I picked this up for her. Um, it's called PIC, two child resistant bait trays. Um, of course, we don't have any children around here, but it's an ant killer bait and uh, it is made in the USA. So anyway, I just picked these up at the Dollar Tree for her to put wherever it is she's having problems with the ants. So I was hoping that that would help. Because that spray stuff to me is just toxic and gets in your face and all that stuff. All right, next I picked up something for me to take lunch tomorrow. This is the Bumblebee Seafood Tuna Salad Sandwich in Seconds. Uh, Bumblebee for Life, it it's 60 calories per package. It has a spoon up here at the top, which is kind of odd. I'm kept trying to figure out what that was. It's a spoon kind of built into that pouch. Kind of cool. Uh, this is distributed by Bumblebee Seeds in San Diego, California. TraceMyCatch.com if you're interested in where your tuna came from, which is very important because there are people in other countries who still um, hunt dolphins to find the tuna. And I don't need to tell you all about how important dolphin safe tuna is to me. A good protein source, it's 2.5 ounces, and it already has the tuna salad made in here. 0.5 uh, fat grams, 60 calories, 5 carbs, 340 milligrams of salt, uh, 20 cholesterols, and 3 sugars. So, and 2 added sugars, which is not bad at all. So, I'll be having that with some bread this week for a sandwich. Uh, actually, I'm taking it tomorrow with some chips and uh, orange for my lunch. The uh, school year, as I told you, nine days left of school. I got some candy for my best kids. Um, I will be making them some little goodie bags with candy in it to say goodbye. Uh, these are Charms Mini mini Pops. Charms Mini Pops. Uh, because I couldn't find, they used to get 40, a package of 40 or something. But these have 30 in them. Tons of cool flavors. There's 30 of them in here. It's a 5.39 ounce package and I picked up two because I didn't know four packets would be enough. And I will be getting some more candy to go with it. And another little toy that I picked out for my younger kids that I'm gonna order on Amazon. Uh, these are really not that bad. It has lots of different flavors. Watermelon, bubblegum, cherry, grape, orange, strawberry, green apple, tropical punch, blue raspberry, banana, cotton candy, strawberry lemonade, orange cream, birthday cake, root beer, 
float, apple pie, mango, and limeade. And I think I got them all. The banana sounds good to me. But um, anyway, I got two packages of the Charm Mini Pops because you get 30 per package. So that will be great for the kids. Little goodie bags that I'm making for them. The other thing that I purchased at the Dollar Tree, because like I said, guys, we just not getting a lot here um, of new stuff yet. Of anything that I need anyway. Uh, praying for you, I got three uh, sympathy cards. I have three different people uh, that I wanted to send a sympathy card for to, and I picked up three beautiful uh, sympathy cards at the Dollar Tree. There's one, there's two, and there's three because I had three different people who had losses in their families in my life, sadly, and um, wanted to send them a card. So anyway, uh, now I'm going to show you what I got my mom for Mother's Day. So I haven't put everything in one of the bags, but I'm going to grab it. Hopefully not knock my camera over. Uh, I did buy her a beautiful card. I think I showed y'all this already. Not sure. I got this at the Dollar Tree. It's one of those Joyfully Your Day Spring cards. And uh, well, I think I showed y'all some of this already. But we're just going to go ahead and show it to you again. <laughs> so, I like spoiling my mom for Mother's Day. So, I picked her up this uh, local store called Kato. Uh, she wanted this, and it is a earring set. It had been $10.99, and I believe it was on sale, but I can't remember, to be honest with you. Uh, but it's pink. It has these little earrings right here, real dainty, with the pink necklace. And then it has a longer necklace with it here. So it's three necklaces in one. There's one here that has this cute little pink charm on it, if y'all can see that. And then there's one at the bottom that has a bumblebee, which I thought was really cute. It reminded me of Sweet Sadie J and all her bumblebee stuff. <clears throat> so anyway, there's three different strands on this and there's one, two, three. And so she wanted this and she really liked it. So I picked it up for her. So she knows she's getting it because she was there with me when she put it out. Then I picked her up from the Dollar Tree this coloring book and these new Pring uh, 36 count uh, colored pencils. So this is a 36 count colored pencils of Pring and then this nice little coloring book that's the Crown Jewels Inspirational. I think y'all saw me that when I called it. I picked her up one of these from the Dollar Tree Delta Home Hand Soap Warm Vanilla because she said that was her favorite. And I picked her up some hydrating hand and nail gloves from the Dollar Tree. And the Mom Every Day I Love You More 22 Coupons book. All that came from the Dollar Tree. And then um, this is the hydrating foot mask for your feet to soften up the feet. We both could use some of that. I think I've got one in there in my bathroom and just need to learn how to use it. Okay, so that's, that's most of what's in one bag. Let me put it all back in there so I can show you what else. Now, last year I bought this at the Dollar Tree. It was $5 and then I painted it. I tried to sell it, but um, never did sell it. So um, she absolutely, she thought it was really pretty. She liked it. She wanted a uh, birdhouse, and I picked her up another birdhouse. I'm about to show you the one at the Hobby Lobby that I bought her. But I wanted to go ahead and give her this one as well because she really liked it when I painted it. She thought it was pretty. And so I painted this. They had them at the Dollar Tree for $5, and I painted it and decorated it. I added this little bird and that little flower to it and the flower got added to it. So I thought this was cute. And she, um, so I'm gonna go ahead and give her this one because she loves birds and she loves bird houses. And this summer, I have some more of those newer bird houses that are longer uh, that they came out with at the Dollar Tree for spring this year. They had one with a bird and a butterfly and a bumblebee and a flower. I think there was four different ones. I will be painting one of the bird ones for her as well but it's gonna have to be after school's out. Cause I just don't have a whole lot of energy right now to do any crafting and I apologize for that. I know it's supposed to be and DIYs, but 
I just haven't had a lot of energy to do any crafting um, lately. So, uh, but this summer I do plan to do that. All right. Okay. So the next thing I got for her, I ordered from the internet. We have tried this pancake mix before. It's really good. You have to order it from the internet. Uh, if you're interested, I'll link it below the website you go to to order the pancake mix. We got the banana caramel around Christmas time and we're almost completely out of it. So I wanted to try a different flavor. And when you buy them, you buy two boxes at a time. And this is the cinnamon bun pancake mix from Cousin T's. And so I will link his website below where you can go if you're interested in this pancake mix. It is gourmet pancake mix. It's the cinnamon bun. He has all different kinds of flavors, even gluten-free. And it came in a box with two in there. And so like I said, our banana was running out. So I wanted to try a different flavor. So I picked the cinnamon bun. So I hope that we will really like that. I can't wait to try it. And then the last thing that I have for her is a, uh, she wanted a birdhouse from Hobby Lobby and they had them 40% off. This one had been $26.99, but it was 40% off of that. I thought this one was really pretty. It was, has a place of the bird here, the bird here. Um, I believe she's planning on putting this outside. It even has this little uh, compartment in the back but if you wanted to put some grass in there for the bird, in case the bird actually does want to lay a nest in there, it could. Or if you wanted to put some bird feed in there. It's kind of long though. I don't know how well the little birdies would do in there, but I thought this one was really, really pretty. It was my favorite one out of the bunch. So I'm hoping that she'll really like it. So I purchased that for her at Hobby Lobby and was excited to find it on sale. Anyway, she's getting two bird houses. <laughs> One that I painted and one that I purchased. So anyway, and she's the one who said, hey, go to Hobby Lobby, they have them on sale. And I was like, okay. Because I was asking her what she wanted and other than the necklace, she would never tell me, but other than she wanted the birdhouse. Thank you so much for watching my channel today. I hope that you have a wonderful day when you're watching this or a wonderful week. Um, I appreciate you so much watching and subscribing. And if you have not subscribed, I would really appreciate it if you would hit that subscribe button. If you'll hit that like button at the bottom, it says a little thumbs up button. If you'll hit that for me, I would appreciate it. It really helps me. And if you'll comment below, I would appreciate it. And if you'll share my video with your friends and say, hey, come over, subscribe, watch her channel, I would appreciate it so, so much. And uh, just remember guys, I love you all and God loves you too. And God bless you. Bye-bye.